Hey everybody, Michael Fisher. Uh, for, uh, who do I work for? Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. We're at. Okay. Alright. Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. Okay, so again. Isn't that magic? Hold on. Okay, start again. Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. I'm here with Michael Fisher. Jaime Rivera is behind the camera. We are at the Venetian in Las Vegas where a lot of the CES press events will take place. And we're going to do a little bit of a prediction video here to talk about what you can expect at CES 2013. <laughs> Somebody shut him up! That was great. Shut him up! Somebody please! Shut him up! Ah! We always know see. Now. Stand by. Stand by for the opera singer. Stand by for opera. Can anybody shut her up? blown by like a dump truck, like an airplane, swing through. I've got two chihuahuas that do that, okay. And row. So this year we expect the most from Sony. Sony really uses CES often as their launching off point for their big phones, and this year it's all about the Xperia Z. It's going to be a 1080p smartphone, nice and thin like the Droid DNA, and we've got some crying babies here, but that's okay. No, it's not. <laughs> Media Pad 10 F, 10 F HD. Ready for you. Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. We're here at CES. That was awesome. Take it again. Okay. Hey everybody, it's Michael Fisher with PocketNow.com. Checking out the Sony Xperia Z. Let's do it again. Where you could see if I can move that around. Looks like it is frozen. Pre production software in the house, not working. Same, but we're glad to see that the dual view has been fixed. One of the best promises here of the Galaxy Note 10.1. Again, pre production software, it is not responding to my touch. That's it for now. No SIM card inside there. If we want to check out. We're going to cut there and talk about what? Here's the doc. Oh, thank you very much, physically. <laughs> so what are you trying to do? Just flip around and see if there's any... A lot of times with Android tablets, there's a little bit of lag. Just kind of want to see if that's sort of eradicated with, uh, with this newer chip. Uh, now you put it in portrait mode. You Ubuntu? Uh, I can never pronounce it right. Ubuntu. Ubuntu. Yes, yeah, exactly. Thank you. I knew it. Go ahead. Infrared keyboards are the things. Start again. That's good. Give me two seconds. I'm going to show you we're at CES 2003, by the way. Start again. <laughs> CES 2003. Hey, everybody. Michael Fisher here at Pocket. Now. With hydrogen fuel cells. Well, in this video, we're going to show you one product that actually does that. Pretty cool. Let's take, let's take a look. Um, does it have a name? It doesn't yeah. have a name. doesn't have a name, yeah. It's a number. Okay, no problem. It actually has a name. So CES is just the start of this year in mobile. We're going to see a lot more stuff at CTIA, Mobile World Congress, of course, later this year, IFA, and so forth. This is just the start. When manufacturers have... Is that that one high note that lingers? Okay, do it now before she starts singing All right, again. All right. We're going to see some interesting stuff here at CES. If you want to miss none of it, make sure and follow us on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs>